for decoration, you can use them for flavor music, but like a motor bar can be used for decoration. This is called a ghost pumpkin. These are very sweet and very good if you want to make a pumpkin pie or something like this. Because they're very good for you, they're very sweet. Um, it has a lot of flesh and a little cavity where all the seeds are. On the inside is white. And then last but not least, this is a butternut squash. On the inside it's orange, it has a little cavity small. All pumpkins are high in vitamin C, vitamin A, and low in fat. And that is well, then you it. Have to touch the yeah. Then don't okay, then touch the guys are, you don't yeah. check. So I don't send you someplace else.
that's a big pumpkin. <laughs> Ooh, let me eat. No, you gotta pay a quarter. Oh, these guys are big. Can we pay one? No. Why? You can't, you can't reach it. Hey, give me food. Give me food. Wait for my. No. I'm a teacher at Tropical Middle School. I teach SDC 6th and 7th grade. And what brings Tropical Middle School out to Tapia's Pumpkin Patch today? I thought it would be a good way to help my students because uh, they struggle with social skills. So it would be a good way to get them out and socializing and interacting with other um, people. And uh, just to learn about the pumpkins because I know I don't know too much about pumpkins. So. Uh, it's great that SKUSD can send out their students to local places like this to learn and have such a fun experience doing that. What message are you trying to teach the students by bringing them out here? <laughs> um, that they should uh, be involved in their community locally instead of going around every like different cities and things. Um, we're supporting companies here in our own city to make it better. Thank you so much. Okay, you're welcome.